uh, over the last few months, MakerDAO uh, did very well as a protocol. Uh, despite this, uh, many whales were starting to lose interest in the token. Uh, as per data from Look and Chain, Block Tower Capital completed transfers of 3,333 Markar to Coindace and Falcon X in the last five hours, accruing around $1.5 million in profits, and the Black Tower Capital initially acquired 12,502 MKR on between the 28th of May and the 14th of November 2022. At press time, the firm's holdings stood at 9,746 MKR with a floating profit of 4.5. The recent actions by Block Tower Capital could influence the broader MKR market in several ways. Notably, such significant transactions may signal confidence or strategic positioning, potentially attracting attention from other market participants. The profits generated could lead to increased interest in MARPAR as an investment contributing to positive sentiment. Is your portfolio green? Check out the MKR profit calculator. Uh, on the flip side, large transactions also have the potential to impact market dynamics. If Block Tower Capital uh, decides to make further moves, it might lead to short-term price fluctuations impacting trading patterns. Uh, traders and investors may closely monitor such activities for cues on potential market trends and adjust their strategies accordingly. At press time, MKR was trading at $1,513.53. In the last 24 hours, its price fell by negative 0.92%. Only time will tell if MKR's price will decline further. Uh, despite the performance of the token, MakerDAO did well uh, with its 5% yield. While 5% yield from the risk-free rate may not sound particularly enticing, Maker has achieved its second highest monthly revenue ever, defying conventional expectations. Notably in 2022, the DAI of a supply was almost double what it is today. And Maker continues to dominate as the leading decentralized application in terms of revenue with a significant gap between its earnings and those of its closest competitors. 5% uh, yield from the risk-free rate might not be a sexy narrative, but Maker just hit its second highest monthly revenue. And, then, uh, and in 2022, the DAI supply was uh, nearly 2x as large as today. Now, Maker remains the number one DAP in terms of revenue, and it's not even close. Uh, revenue in the uh, the uh, I was never open to my parents. Uh, we'll be honest about how to whether or nine people be streamed uh, uh, fatal, taking really 75 uh, economic.